Hello YouTube, I'm doing a redstone tutorial because I am bored and why do I have a shovel if I'm in creative mode? Well anyway, um, I am going to be showing you how to do a door operated by a single button which opens and closes whenever you wish. So I'm just setting it up really quick. This is... I think, I think, I'm not sure actually, I think it's somewhere around that amount of height and deepness and wide, 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 variety, you know what I'm saying? Also, it's a basic thing that's pretty simple, actually, it's just, this is how to make like a door. is gonna be the door has to be over this block so it has to be like this and then door it should be like that and then when you put the torch there it should open and then you just gotta do this and then this so then that will close the door if it doesn't, then you're doing something wrong here. That. Okay, so then you just do this. And then I've never tried this next thing, so I'm not sure if this is going to work. If I can put a button in that. Yeah, I didn't think that would work. So I'll just put the button right there. And then it operates it, so then you can just do this. Yeah, pull this in. You could probably, because I have no idea, you could just probably put like a torch or something, so I'll see if that works. I'm just, I'll show you what I'm doing. Oh wait, I got a better way to test that. So if you do that... Yeah, that wouldn't even work. So you just gotta go like, boop, 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 boop. Let's connect the redstone up. Put that right there. That break button here. Press open. And so you will hear pistons, but it's like a more smaller design. You can go through. And then you can just hook up the same thing on the other side, so it's like... This, and then you just bring it to the other button, and you have it so it's like that, and then button it. Except you put that over there. Okay, thanks for watching, and that is all. Bye.